New Zealanders are good travellers. They travel overseas and they go to Spain or Morocco and they see a house there and they say, wow, I can build that in New Zealand. They forget very often that in New Zealand it rains, in Morocco it doesn't. Uh, not only does it rain, but it rains horizontally at times with the wind that we get. So to build a house uh, in New Zealand, you've got to build it according to New Zealand conditions. And there's a couple of rules of thumbs that, that we tend to push pretty strongly, and that is that we avoid parapets, we avoid clipped eaves, we avoid flat roofs, so that we are reasonably sure that the building is going to be waterproof. But once you go, and, and of course the customer is, is king in this, they tell you what they want. <laughs> And to some extent, we can advise them, but if they want something against our advice, then there could be problems. Um, and while we can try and avoid those problems, uh, there are some just sensible things that you can do that can avoid them. And that, that, that includes internal gutters. Uh, get rid of the water beyond the roof. Don't try and trap the, the water inside the roof and then channel it out because there are problems with birds and leaves and all that sort of stuff that blows around blocking your gutter and causing a leak.